let's talk a bit about social media so we have a better grasp of what it's all about. <clears throat> First off, we need to think of communication and think about it as not about what you say than about what people understand. So communication, the, the usual mistake when we talk about communication is communication is all about what I say. <laughs> so after I say it, I'm done. I've communicated. No, it's what's more important is what the, the person you're talking with understood about it. Because if you have not effectively conveyed your message and the person understood what you were talking about, if that didn't happen, no matter um, how much of volume of words you bring out, you're not communicating. Okay, so you have to constantly check if the person got what to say. Okay? So what I'm saying is, it's more important for the other person to capture what you're talking about, to get your message. Okay, so that should be the focus of, of our communication. And there's a big difference between traditional media and social media. Maybe some of us have been more accustomed to traditional media. Traditional media has often been, um, they treat audiences as a passive receiver. We're broadcasting to everybody. We're, we have the TV show, we have a, a radio ad, we have a, an ad published in the newspaper, we're bringing it out, and people are simply receiving it. They're passively receiving it. In the social media, your audience is an active participant in the whole thing. You're not simply receiving, they are engaged. They, they become part of a conversation. They're active. Okay. Um, in traditional media, because of the capital involved, there are only a limited number. Uh, that are available, television channels, radio stations, and, and not all radio stations and not TV channels are ideal because it uh, depends on how many audiences you have. You have newspapers and magazines that are folding up, limited. But in social media, there's simply an explosion of the number of channels available uh, because everything is online. The, the barrier to entry is small, is low. So a lot of channels are being um, set up every time. Yeah, with traditional media, once you pull it up, it's, it's done, it's, it's fixed. With, with uh, social media, it's dynamic, you can update it. If you make a mistake, you can correct it. Okay? It's not fixed. Um, and in traditional media, the person Offering something is a leader, and you know I'm the authority. I'm giving this out to you, and uh, I can't do anything about it. Just buy my product. But with social media, the person offering something is a listener. You're in a conversation. I'm offering this. I want to know what you think, and you get involved in a discussion, a conversation about about your offer. So you can actually make adjustments on your offer depending on what people are, are saying about it. And we need to point out that the social in social media is not about it in a channel, it is about behavior. Um, most people visit social networking sites to connect with others, to stay in touch with friends and family, to share things with colleagues and peers, uh, to meet strangers with similar interests and needs. Okay? Um, and there's this technology part that makes it happen. Uh, but for most people, social media are just means to an end. With that end being social interaction. When we talk about social media, we may become enamored with the idea that we're, you know, we're setting up these social media channels and you know, we have Twitter and we have... That's not the main point. The main point is about the people who are 
becoming part of a community. The social media channel is just a platform, an instrument to make it happen. If the community is not being formed, even if you have a number of channels there, <laughs> it's useless. What is more important is that a community is being formed and you have the technology, you use the technology to allow for a, you know, a robust conversation, for more people to come in, for a, you know, an online conversation happening. You need social media to make it happen. Don't, let's not fall in love with social media for its own sake.